ஹாய் ஹலோ எவ்ரி ஒன் வெல்கம் டு டுடேஸ் வீடியோ லெக்சர் அண்ட் கெஸ் வாட் டுடே ஐ எம் கோயிங் டு ஸ்டார்ட் வித் ஜென்ரல் பேப்பர் டாபிக் தட் இஸ் எஜுகேஷன் சிஸ்டம் டூரிங் ஏன்ஷியன்ட் மெல்டீவல் அண்ட் மாடர்ன் பீரியட் ஹியர் த மீனிங் ஆஃப் மெடிவல் மீன்ஸ் மிடல் ஏஜ் ஓகே லெட்ஸ் கெட் ஸ்டார்ட் இன் அண்ட் யூ நோ வாட் ஐ ஹவ் சூசன் த கொஷன்ஸ் uh from moceset uh, and uh, net papers and and uh, and uh, some of the questions i felt which are very important for the exam which may arrive in the exam okay so it's better to solve the papers if you want to write it down you can pause the video whenever you want and write it down that's very good let us move on start with the first one Education is natural harmonious and progressive development of man's innate power who said this and this said by pestolozzi okay uh, he said that education is natural and it means that education should be natural and it should also harmonious means it is very brings the happiness brightness means harmonious it should be friendly you know, between the teacher and the student and it should be progressive not regressive that development of man's innate power innate means inborn power education should develops the man's inborn power inborn skills that actually means the education to him to whom pestolozzi and jan dew also said about uh, education he said that education is the process of continuous reconstruction of experiences he said like that and aristotle a very famous uh, education word uh, he says that education is the creation of sound mind in a sound body okay and coming to rabindranath tagore rabindranath tagore said that highest education is that uh, which doesn't merely gives us information but makes our life in harmony with all existence so these are the sentences said by this famous persons okay let us move on to the next one when the right of children when the right of children to free and compulsory education act 2009 became operative in the country the options are here 1st march 2010 1 april 2010 1 january 2010 1 may 2010 the answer is 1 april 2010 in that period right of children to free and compulsory education act became operative in the country let us move on to the next one secondary education comprises classes of it comprises secondary education okay it comprises cl- classes from 9 to 12th okay you should have to remember this is important uh, for the examination next let let us move on to the next question under which constitutional amendment the right to education has been made as a fundamental right the answer is 86th amendment okay let us move on to the next one which ancient university was one of the world's first residential university the world's first residential university is nalanda university let us move on to the sixth question here the sixth question says consider the following sentence and find out the correct answer the first sentence is in the ancient period people had a belief that though religious education they would attain salvation salvation means saved they believed like that means in the ancient period people had a belief that though religious education they would attain salvation okay they attained the salvation from the uh, religious education they thought like that second sentence gurukula system of education is also known as vedic system of education second say, second sentence says that gurukula system of education is also known as vedic system of education third statement in the vedic system of education pupils occupied a vital position as compared to their guru or teacher the answer is first and second these two are the correct sentences this one and 
this one obviously they be believed like the ancient people they believed that religious through religious education they they would attain the salvation and gurukula system of education is also known as vedic system of education but here third one is wrong because we know that guru always forms the highest position in our life so we will become the low okay he no, pupil will never occupy his role he is the vital have the vital position in our life okay he, he, he now also in also in the vedic system also okay that's why first and second answer are correct let us move on to the next one indians in indian institute of science was established in which year this was a memory type kind of question you should have to remember that is in the year 1909 let's move on to the next question which university of higher education was situated in tamil nadu answer is enayuram and this ujjaini is as i know uh, this ujjaini is found in situated in madhya pradesh and coming to odantapuri um, odantapuri which is located in bihar and coming to salotgi it is located in karnataka in the bijapur uh place okay the answer they are asking about tamil nadu so the answer is enaviram okay let us move on to the next one students of which university were generally offer higher higher post so eight question have been solved so uh, let's solve the another eight questions i hope you may answer uh, for these uh, questions the ninth question is the ninth one is students of which university were generally offer higher post in those time the university is answer for this is vallabhi university those university students used to offer higher post okay let us move on to the next question that is 10th one name the emperor who set up and established vikramashila university this university is established by the emperor dharmapala okay remember which university vikramashila university was established by dharmapala and set up and established by dharmapala let us move on to the 11th one occasional education start from which class from which class occasional education starts and then Uh, that means that from which class we should have to provide the educational uh, uh, vocational education to the students uh, the options are like this 6th class 10th class 12th class and 8th class the answer for this is from 6th class we can provide the edu- occasional education okay and remember the uh, as i told before some of the questions have chosen from kset and net exam so these questions are important so make a note on these questions let us move on to the 12th question which university had largest library in the ancient world so largest library in the ancient world uh, which university they are asking the first question naida nalanda salotgi and maithili the answer is nalanda nalanda has the largest library let us move on to the third one 13th one which is which is the first university established all across the global so all across the global the first university established is taxila okay next one in the age of four vedas students were admitted to the veda schools after performance of which ceremony the answer for this uh, the options are like like this upanayana ceremony ushatarajana ceremony third one satapata ceremony third one dhanurvidya ceremony the answer is upanayana ceremony move on to the next question in which of the following ancient indian universities the culture and civilization of tibet was built mainly through the writing of the scholars options are like this first one nalanda second one vikramashila 
थर्ड वन जगदलाला जगदलाला फोर्थ वन मैथिला द आंसर फॉर दिस फिफ्टींथ वन इज विक्रम शाला दे टिबेट वॉज बिल्ड मेनली थ्रू द राइटिंग ऑफ द स्कॉलर्स द कल्चर अँड सिव्हिलायझेशन ऑफ द टिबेट वॉज बिल्ड मेनली थ्रू द रायटिंग ऑफ द स्कॉलर्स इन द विक्रमशिला युनिव्हर्सिटी द लास्ट क्वेश्चन इन विच इयर द मॉडर्न इंडियन युनिव्हर्सिटी गॉट एस्टाब्लिश इन विच इयर द ऑप्शन आर लाईक दिस नाईन्टीन फोर्टी सेव्हन नाईन्टीन सिक्स्टी फोर नाईन्टीन फिफ्टी सेव्हन अँड एटीन फिफ्टी सेव्हन अँड आन्सर फॉर दिस इज एटीन फिफ्टी सेव्हन ओके थँक्यू एव्हरी